performance. Now guys, after two years of lying to ourselves, I think it's time we all admit the truth. It's time to admit that the mainstream media is the sole source of truth in this world and would never lie to us or do anything against our best interests. Today is also the time to admit that everything they said about Batflu was correct and all claims against the miracle jab was Russian disinformation or far-right nutjobs spreading said misinformation. We should also admit that not a single person had a bad reaction to the old poke because Batflu was to blame for all of it like the BBC said. In fact, we must also admit that it's totally normal for kids of all ages to suffer heart attacks and myocarditis just like it's totally normal for the same to happen to football players, sports stars and even fans in the stadium because the government and media would never lie to us and only have our best interests at heart. Shit, while we're being honest, we should also admit that Putin is like Hitler and everything the media says about the Ukraine war is 100% correct while any claims to the contrary are once again Russian disinformation. In fact, since we're not biologists, we should also admit that chicks can have dicks because gender's just a social construct and biology's not real science. On top of all that, it's time we agree that mass immigration helps the UK and those poor refugees crossing the channel should be helped because we must admit that white people are evil racist bigots that are given a helping hand by the world at the expense of ethnic minorities. Essentially what I'm saying is, The Guardian, BBC, government and the rest of them are all great people who care about us deeply and never lie. All these years we've either been wrong or lying to ourselves, which is obviously not good for our health. So guys, please accept my sincerest apologies for lying to you in all my previous videos. I've now seen the error of my ways and it's time for honesty, which I have to say feels good to get off my chest.